Like damn, she need her move. Like damn, she need her move. Like damn, she need her move. Hey y'all, last vlog, I left you guys off with me doing yoga. Thank you for those who stayed and watched me do yoga. Um, but after that, I had like took a little break, a little a mental break in a sense, calm down. And then I came downstairs to um, juice. So uh, you guys just saw like the little juices or whatnot. This week I made two versus making shots this week. Um, this week, my recipe for my juicing every week is typically the same. Hmm. Um, my juicing for my juicing typically is the same, which is celery, cucumber, uh, green apple, which is the Johnny green apple. No, Granny Smith, the Granny Smith green apple it's kale that I cannot pronounce or I forgot. And I actually forgot the name of it, but it's a um, organic. It's organic kale that look like um, crocodile skin. Mm. But I mix those together and then the, when I am ready to drink it, I will squeeze lime in it. Um, and if I want it spicy or whatnot, during that time, then I would add in um, like cayenne pepper or black pepper in it. But yeah, I just made those and that's, I typically do that every week. Those uh, those ingredients help with inflammation. Oh, the other one. Oh yeah, I forgot, I forgot. The most important is ginger. Ginger, ginger, ginger. Ginger is my best friend. It is the best detox. It's actually like reference of a detox, detox drink. And um, it helps with cleaning out your gut, making sure that everything flows well. It attacks inflammation. So yeah. It's Sunday meal prep i juice i got myself together mentally physically for the upcoming week thank god this is a holiday week um but now i'm just about to just go edit so i can push another vlog out <laughs> Good morning guys today is july 1st it is the next day welcome to july happy july 1st happy rent mortgage day happy bills day happy third quarter all that yeah good stuff um whew. we're in the second half of the year i hope that you guys have had a great year so far and or starting to see a turnaround if you experience any type of hardship um so yeah i am about to weigh in weigh myself or whatnot uh like i had mentioned earlier in the vlog or last vlog about my goal for july so i am about to take some body pictures get on the scale and do some body measurements or whatnot I have on like this little two piece. I'll show y'all this. So I have on this little, this two piece. This two piece is actually from Shein. He do what I tell him. I do what I want to do. How they fucking talking, but let's see who really make a move. Post a picture, bitches call me mother. Now who's son and who? Day two, I'm about to walk about two miles. Maybe three. I don't know yet. But day two, walking. Hi, people. It is, um, today is July 3rd, day before 4th of July. It is day three of, of me working out or doing some type of exercise every day. So, um, I just pulled up to Memorial Park. If you are in Houston, you know this is off of I-10, uh, freeway is... A lot of people come up here. It's like they have like run clubs, they have volleyball, soccer, all type of stuff. Tennis is a golf course in the middle or whatnot. So um, I'm about to just go ahead and get it. When you go around one time, it is um, three miles. So I'm not sure yet if I'm going to jog. I don't want to say run because um, of my knee, but I'm going to get three miles again. So yeah. Here we go.
No. Y'all, why, why did I leave my fucking shoes in the garage at home? Oh my gosh, this is like, this is bad as leaving your headphones when you go to the gym. How in the hell am I supposed to go run, walk, do anything without any shoes? Clearly, I, I drove with, um, just with socks on. Oh, all right, so I'm about to just look in the trunk and see if I have an extra pair of shoes in there. If not, then this drive was a waste and... It's really gonna discourage me from actually doing anything if my shoes not in the trunk Y'all oh! Okay Good news and bad news Good news is I do have some shoes. These are like my old faithfuls. I ran with these shoes for years uh, I thought I threw them away. So it's actually good that they were in the trunk bad news is They're so worn that they don't give me support so I wouldn't be able to like fully run or jog if I wanted to not making excuses or anything of that nature, but it doesn't give me a uh, support as I thought. And that's part of why my knee is messed up. Enjoy not to. <laughs> Okay, y'all, we did five miles a day. Woo -woo. I'm ready to pull up with you. I'm ready to do what I do. Baby, what you wanna do? Put your shot, cause I'm bulletproof. Oh, that's a way we make Love me up, do, do, do. Baby, what you wanna do? So it is July 4th. It is officially, obviously, day four of me working out every day. I said I was going to do this, so I am trying. Today, I'm going to do strength training because yesterday I walked five miles. Um, I really want to go run today, but y'all, it is just so hot. I will have to get up like six, seven o'clock in the morning just to try to beat the heat so much i just feel like i'm gonna pass out it's just so humid and hot but nevertheless we're gonna get it done so um i am about to make a salad so i'm just show y'all what i put in my salad baby lettuce mix this is from trader joe's so Chicken, this is also from Trader Joe's. It's like already pre-made. It's basically just white chicken breast. All right, and then I have some sun-dried tomatoes. It's from Trader Joe's too. I'm gonna use all of these. And then I have um, a boiled egg. I'm just going to put some of these. My dressing or whatever, I will just use stuff that we already have. Here is some lemon juice olive oil, black pepper. I like peppers. Garlic, garlic powder, pink salt. And also, I'm just gonna, yeah. And then oregano. Mix all this together. I, I guess I need to get those little salad things but hey okay, y'all now i'm about to get into this workout for today so it'll be day four and day four will be strict training so i'll see you guys later i say who baby hi y'all okay so this is july 5th so it'll be the fifth day that we are working out every day um i low-key kind of didn't want to do anything but i promised myself and i said i was gonna do this so today i am walking um, I'm just gonna like walk around for about an hour or so 
I don't know, give or take. And we'll just do the time. I already have my Nike app on and it's telling me to go. So I'll catch y'all later. Okay, y'all, I finished um, my workout for, or my moving fitness exercise uh, for today. So this is day five. I got day, I got five for five. Pew, 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 pew. Um, anyway, after I had finished walking, I was like, oh, I need to go to the mailbox. So we went to the mailbox. Um, so the beginning of June, I ordered some shoes, which are supposed to be like some Gucci slides, but obviously they're the dupes. So I'm about to see, I'm about to open it right now. This is what this package is. I'm about to open it right now to see if I got some dupes or I got duped. So here we go. Here we go to the end. And I got two pairs. I got some black and, ooh, okay. Okay, one, we know they're not the real ones because the presentation. What is this? Anyway, we know that they're, we know that they're dupes. I got a size, I'm supposed to get a size 10 in both, but it looked like one says a size 41. Oh no, they're both a size 10. Okay, y'all, now I need to go online and see how the, it didn't need to go online or go inside the store, like maybe to like Gucci or Neiman's Markets, and see how the original Gucci slides look. Because here are the black ones. So here we go. And they say Gucci on it, um, made in Italy. I don't know if that's how Gucci really is, but here's a little backing of it. We're definitely going to take that off. But. Yeah, they're, they're a little little flimsy, but it's the black ones. And then they had a little sale and you buy one, but if you buy multiple, your cost per shoe decreased. So I got it in cream as well. So here's the cream one. Same layout, Gucci made in Italy. Hope y'all can see that. But so here we go. They smell okay. I mean, they don't smell like use or nothing. But some about them, I don't know. However, it took them what a month and a half to get here, so they probably just smell like shipping or something. Let me try them on, even though y'all can't see. Okay, let me let me put y'all down so y'all can see y'all. Y'all seen the shoes? Can y'all please comment down below and let me know, did I do a good job with these shoes, these dupes, or it's a no sis, don't wear those or whatnot. But keep in mind, my coins will never pay for Gucci uh, slides, like hundreds of dollars for any slides. It don't even matter if they're Gucci, like any type of uh, slides. Like I'm not spending all that money for it. Um, but I actually do like them and if they're a good dupe or whatnot Okay, it kind of reminds me of smelling like coffee hmm. If they're a good dupe or whatever, let me know in the comment section or whatnot But I'm gonna try to insert the original shoe So you guys can like compare it and see it against We made it to the park. We made it to the park. Okay, so because I have been doing this for 
years, aka running, walking, exercising, whatever, jogging, how you want to put it. I've been jogging for a long, long time. Like I grew up, um, what size is this? I, I grew up um in sports, like track, volleyball. I tried basketball one time, but baby, you ain't gonna embarrass me. I ain't not a dribble ball. But oh excuse me. Um <clears throat> yeah, I grew up just being like super active, dancing. All, all the all the things all the things so um unfortunately that has played a part on my knee and i'll still be trying to do stuff y'all always hear me complain about my knee or whatever but we're gonna go to the doctor on monday to see what it is um so i'm just i'll just put on my knee brace and then i'm about to put on like my sweatband before we get out of the car so um y'all for somebody who do not like pink everything i swear i'll be getting like my headphones pink my shoes are pink my sweatband pink like everything is pink like even if i go on like my for like my um makeup stuff travel things i always get pink it's just a pretty color but it's not my favorite color so anyway y'all i am rambling we are about to get on it i'm about to turn my headphones on listen to some music and I don't know which one of these headphones are actually working and that won't die. I'm I'm gonna use these. I hope they don't. I hope they don't die. Either way, I don't expect nobody to call me, so I got. I guess I just get these. Anyway, all right, y'all, let's go. We out chill. It actually feels nice for it to be ninety some degrees outside. I'm not gonna want to carry this big ass towel, but I just know once I get into it, I'm gonna be so hot. Y'all, I'm not gonna freaking lie. It is so hot out here. Y'all, I'm trying to control my breathing, but it ain't happening. I gotta stop. Y'all, it is so hot. I wanna go. I wanna go home. I wanna go home. But I can't because. Oh, Oh. I'm so far in this mile that I can't turn around. So I have to finish. Y'all, it's so hot. Who told me to do this? Who? Oh, I do some stupid stuff. Such a glorious time. I see my car. Oh, Jesus. I feel dehydrated, exhausted. Like maybe I'm about to pass out. Y'all, this cannot be the same heat. I played in as a child. It can't. I refuse. Like, what? My car say it's 93 degrees. Good gosh. Good gosh. Oh Jesus, thank you for air. Oh Jesus. All right, y'all, I'm exhausted. When I calm down, I'll pick y'all back up. If you wanna be my lover. Hey, y'all, it started raining when I was driving really bad, so I ain't getting no heads up, no nothing. Anywho, um, I'm here in the restroom, just trying to get myself together, you know. Y'all know when you come in, 
no matter who you beat, you go to the restroom first. Make sure everything good. Okay. Alright. Y'all, this big, look at this to my hand. Wow. Cheers. Congratulations! Okay, friends, I am back in the car. I am about to head home. It is raining, so I'm not going to pick up my camera while I'm driving. But the storm is on its way, or probably here. I don't know. I haven't been keeping up with the news. Anywho, um, thank you so much for joining me in this vlog. I really appreciate you guys uh, for going on this journey with me as we are just enjoying life and learning more about fibroids. Oh, but not but in between time and the meantime take care of yourself y'all be good peace oh wait also before i go before i go please make sure that you like comment and subscribe to the video share with a friend have them subscribe your girl is on a journey thank you so much for joining me on this vlog i'll see y'all in the next one peace bye oh jesus he ain't hoover glow, never got the cookie, but got my name, tiny killer work.